Hi there, I'm Dave Marks, and today I'm going to be demoing for you the classic Music Man Ernie Ball Stingray. This Stingray is the biggest seller in the Ernie Ball Music Man range, uh, and it's with good reason. It has a great sound. It's a simple bass in design. We have a big fat humbucker back here at bridge position. We have volume control, and then bass, middle, and treble boost and cut. Everything this bass does has deep, powerful bass sound in it. Now, it has a classic tone that we're all familiar with. Great for really aggressive rock playing, or great for a bit of funk. So you have those sounds built in automatically. With the versatility of the EQ in it though, it's useful for a lot of different styles. Take for example, rolling off the treble, boosting a little bit of the bass. we get a much warmer, deeper, fatter sound. Um, I remember growing up listening to players like Tony Levin playing on Peter Gabriel tracks. That kind of vibe you can definitely get with a little bit of simple EQ tweaking. In the clips that I've put on here, I've gone for a slightly unusual selection of music, a bit of reggae and a bit of drum and bass. You can see how this bass really responds with that deep fat sound, well suited to modern playing styles like electronica, jungle drum and bass, and also classic styles that require that deep bass sound like dub and reggae. <laughs> So that's the Ernie Ball Music Man Classic Stingray 4. Get down to your local stockist, get your hands on one, have a play. You'll find it has that classic Stingray sound, but it also has a lot of other sounds in it that you could bring out in your own playing. Check out musicmanuk.co.uk and you'll see the entire range of Ernie Ball Music Man basses and find the one that's exactly right for your playing style. 